about to go down these freaking roads though. What a dick. You're kidding. A little punk tries to throw me off a train. We get into a fight and he falls off. Cops ask me why I did a thing like that. I tell them why. For three hours I tell them why. They don't believe me. Right then, so this is the story of what happened yesterday at Gem Speed Shop. I'm about to go down these freaking roads though, what a dick. You can tell us what we're doing. We're off to rescue a fool. That's Who? what we're off to do. Who is this fool? The fool that I employ to deliver bikes. Decided to go down the smallest country road he could find, the biggest snowballs that he could find. But he got stuck. So here we go to rescue him. <laughs> and my square is frozen. I've got no squirty. Mm. 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 You buy a 40 grand Range Rover. Mm. <laughs> you get a free bottle of water to throw in winter. And a lad to throw it on for you. <laughs> the plan was quite simple. It was going to be me, Dave, Josh, and Lee to go and help the delivery driver recover the van that he'd managed to get stuck in basically a ditch of snow out on, I think it was Saddleworth Moors. One thing that we encountered a lot of was experts in weather. Cottages, eh? Yeah, there's, no, there's nowhere through that way. There's a car blocked here because it's drifted right across, so... Can't get through, and then when you go a little bit lower down, it's right up at top of a vehicle where it's all drifted across, so... That's the... Is there yeah. a big van down there? There is a van. So the he jumps speed up on it? Oh, he is. No, he's waiting oh, for you, yeah. So. But snag is there's a guy here, and he can't get his out oh, because well. it's all drifted across here. Right, no worries, pal. So it's, uh, yeah, it'd be just probably walking. No through, worries. But, yeah. All right, cheers, cheers. pal. Yeah, we'll show you how to get around, pal. How the fuck is this near Wales? <laughs> <laughs> is that what he's on about? Which way is it now? Is it down there? Um, yeah, you could either turn left there, or this way. We can get this guy out, can't we? Do you not realise we're in the Land Rover? I won't go around there, we'll go get stuck. Yeah. If not, we go back the other way. What are you shaking your head at, you knob? You just think you're a fucking heavy vehicle. <laughs> Ask me if we'll drag him out. There's a van stuck down there, we need to get him out, mate. Oh, really? Yeah. Just constantly. Oh, you're never going to get through there, you're never going to get through there. Dave won't take him no for an answer. We've got a van down there that's stuck, mate. We'll have to rescue him. I really don't want to go down, trust me. <laughs> a bunch of experts around here, aren't there? Yeah. yeah. Oh, you're telling us what we shouldn't shunt, though. <laughs> Country bumpkins. <laughs> Move to the city, you don't get any of this. Now, don't get me wrong, it was really bad, and at one point we did get stuck. I can't see, though. I literally can't see out. Stuck, boys. Yeah. Oh, we're moving. We're moving. Come on! Get in! 
Jesus! I am a million percent regret getting out of that. Christ. Where's Lee? This side. Open boot, for him. Open boot, quick. How'd you do it? <laughs> Open it. Jesus. Oh, it's cold. <laughs> <laughs> Proper cold. Come on, man, we can still fucking see. <sighs> My hat. My hat's ruined. <laughs> <laughs> I'm wet through, look at me. Jeez, my eyes. Wow. I'm not going to make a Jack Donald. Oh, I'm, I'm sure many of you followed our antics on the Gem Speed Shop Instagram page. We uh, live streamed the whole thing, which was quite funny. And we also put a little video on last night as a teaser for what, what actually happened with trying to recover the van. Eventually, we got to the van and we hooked on first with the yellow tow line. Uh, and then start try to pull it out. That tow line completely snapped, so then we had to use ratchet straps that hook on together a bit like that. Uh, but as long as it's under tension, it wouldn't come loose. But if we lose tension, then it'd unhook, and that was that. Come on, girl, pull it out. Oh, that doesn't look good, that Dave. I'm not gonna lie. There's a bit of damage somewhere. <laughs> But you know, all for the good cars and all that. Oh! Shut up! <laughs> He's gonna run over the shop. <laughs> Why would you run it over? <laughs> Honestly, you couldn't write it. It was like a Laurel and Hardy sketch. The lads jump out because the first line had snapped. They're trying to hook on the ratchet strap, and at the same time, an ambulance needed to come through. So a tractor with a plow on the front of it comes plowing through and just threw all the snow over the ladders trying to connect the ratchet strap up whilst we were stuck in a ditch. It were, it were priceless. Oh yeah, it fucking comes down, doesn't it? This tractor. I'm not flashing, so it's easier. Police car behind the ambulance. Don't think Lee's got Jesus. hypothermia. <laughs> yeah, thanks a lot, dickhead. <laughs> so yeah, after all that, we did actually manage to recover the van. It took quite a bit of towing. We had to pull it a long way, but we did recover it. And then the van went on its way to carry on delivering bikes. So what do you reckon then, Dave? Well, you know, all in a day's work. We managed to get him out. We had some fun. Sorry about all the swearing, but <laughs> you know, that's me. That's it, Dave, on to the next video. Cool. Catch you on the next one. See you later, guys. Done and dusted? Yeah. Yeah. Oh dear.